Part of my role as research manager is that I manage the breeding effort. Our goal in our breeding effort is to create better hybrids for the farmers, better yielding, more stable, stronger, more sound agronomics that can help the farmers succeed. One technique that we use in the breeding effort to do this is the double haploid technique, and one that we actually use pretty extensively in our breeding effort. The double haploid technique is a way to create an instant inbred line, one that actually is a true breeding line. Traditionally, this breeding effort would take about seven, eight generations in order to self down to over 99% homozygosity. With the uh, double haploid technique, we're able to get there in just three generations. The double haploid technique actually gets us to that 100% homozygous stage in about a year or three cycles. So as with most organisms, corn is a diploid species, meaning that it gets one copy of its DNA from its mother, one from the father. So both parents contribute half of the genetic component. What happens in a haploid though is one of those components actually disappears. In the case of our double haploids, it's the pollen parent actually disappears in about 10% of the time, leaving just a single copy of the chromosome, a haploid. We then take that kernel, sprout it, and we treat it with a chemical that causes that DNA to double, creating an instant homozygous true breeding line. Every loci on that DNA is identical to the other copy, meaning that it will be every generation, every subsequent generation will be the same. What the farmer sees is exactly what me, the breeder, is seeing from day one. So the true power of this doubled haploid technique comes in both speed and precision. The line that we're testing in the field is exactly the same line that we're going to see in the farmer's field. We can combine this with our Bex precision techniques that we utilize now pretty exclusively in our breeding effort. Through computer modeling, we are able to model thousands and even millions of hybrids before they ever go to the field, taking only the best of the best. This doubled haploid being true breeding, it allows for very strong predictions, very strong modeling in the computer, to where what we see in the computer is very indicative of what we will see in the field. You take this across an entire breeding population of a few hundred lines, we are literally choosing among millions of hybrids to take to the field. It allows us to bring to the Bex Farmer customer hybrids that are truly one in a million.